Welcome back to Houston Life. Yonuts Donut and Ice Cream is famous for their one of a kind smashed donut, a yeah. smashed donut. So it's a fresh homemade donut stuffed with ice cream, smashed, hot pressed, and then loaded up with a whole bunch of toppings. No surprise, it has already gone viral, Harper, on TikTok. The team just opened their first Texas location in Pearland, and over the weekend, and over, sorry, and Lauren Kelly is giving us a look at their new dessert experience. Hey, Lauren. Hey, you guys, I know that you may have had some delicious desserts before, but this stands on its own. We are here at Yonuts, a brand new spot right here for dessert. I would call it an experience, Chris. Chris Allen, one of the co-founders here, we're so excited to come and stop in at Yonuts because this has been all over TikTok. It's been all over social media, and there's a reason because you have some delicious desserts that look like this. Yeah. <laughs> we're looking at some video now of kind of the birthday cake smash donut. Tell us about the concept of a smash donut. Yeah, so I'll tell you what it is real quick and I'll tell you a little bit about how it came to fruition. But what it is, is we take a whole donut, cut it in half, put ice cream in it, hot press it back together for about 10 seconds, cut it open again and then top it. And I know what you're thinking, it's too much sweetness, it's gonna you know, overload me. But guess what, it's not. The donut itself only has two and a half grams of sugar, so it doesn't overpower you on that. And the you know ice what, cream does Chris, you were so nice, you took all the calories out for us. And that's what we have right here. Absolutely. <laughs> we're looking at some, not only the, the smash donut, you've got yeah. that, which is in a bunch of different flavors. You've got the donuts, you've also got the smashed milkshake. So what is the difference? Obviously, it is a milkshake, but what is smash? What makes it a smashed milkshake? So if you can see in the background here, we use a special blender. It's a, uh, it kind of looks like a big drill press, right? So we put a bunch of stuff in there, like uh, in this one, for example, we have some vanilla wafers and a mini donut, and we smash them all together and then spit it out the bottom and put these beautiful donuts on top. I love the story of this spot because for all the people that did see it on social media, you guys were on Shark Tank. Like this was a product that was so good that everybody kind of knew it's yeah. going somewhere and I'm so happy that you took it here to Texas. This is your first Texas location, right? Yeah, it is. So a little bit more backstory on that. Back in uh, 2018, Guy and his wife, Tony and Ginny Bahu, had, uh, had bought a, a struggling uh, frozen yogurt and donut store ended up turning it into what it is now, kept that name, put in ice cream, put the two together. And then about that same time, a guy named Kevin Harrington again was looking for a cool dessert concept, came across this, ended up getting into business with them, and then wanted to take it nationwide. So and we here are we are, store. here yeah. we are. Of course, Angelo is the TikTok star that we all know and love. Correct. He was here for the grand opening. You guys just opened on Saturday. I saw that there were so many people. And you know what, Chris? It's a perfect way to stay cool yeah. in this like upwards of 110 degree weather, right? Oh, I know. It's uh, it's oppressive out there. And, and like you said, these, uh, these milkshakes in particular have been huge for us. But I'll tell you what, even though you're going to get hot donut right here, you're going to get cold ice cream on the inside. So what please don't pass it up. Harper and Derek, don't don't, don't be jealous, but I'm just gonna go. Oh my god, I'm just gonna go ahead and take a ginormous bite right now. Oh my god, oh my god, I'm missing out. So, coming up in just a coming up in just a little bit, I'm gonna do I'm gonna show you guys how this is made if I can get it out of my mouth. <laughs> Chris, thank you so much. Thank you. I'm gonna try to bring you back to some in Studio B. No guarantee. Please try, Lauren. Please down. try. Is it a 10 out of 10? You got to tell us. It's an 11. It's an it's 11. 11. Oh, wow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. If mm -hmm. it gets Lauren's votes, Ooh. it must be good. Cheers. Lauren, thank <laughs> you. We'll see you in a little while. Well, we have been hanging out in Pearland all day here this afternoon at Yonuts Donut and Ice Cream Shop. It's a brand new concept that uses smashed donuts to make smashed donuts and milkshakes. And the result is absolutely delicious. It's a perfect way to cool down this summer. And the, the, the place is brand new. And Chris Allen's been giving me a little bit of a lesson on how things are made, done the right way, the wrong way. But now we're going to learn how you actually make some of the smashed donuts. Because I tasted one, and you, you really get to get the flavor with the warm donut and the cold yeah. ice cream. And it's just magnifique. So yeah. how do we make it? <laughs> so here's what we do. I already got a little bit ahead of myself, but we first cut this thing open into a half. And, and is this just a regular donut, right? We're not using any flavors here. Correct. So this donut we make is, we call it a shell. It's just a blank donut, nothing on top. It's the type you would normally fill with something inside. Okay, of it. okay. 
So the one we're going to make is called strawberry shortcake to match that, that beautiful shake you had earlier. That but shake was unbelievable. We put a little bit of strawberry jelly inside of it. Okay. And I'm going to walk over to the ice cream counter here. And you guys have out. plenty of different ice cream flavors. And this donut, this smash donut, is one of how many flavors you have here. There's a, a significant amount of different flavors for people to choose from. So right now, we actually offer about 13 different types. Okay. And starting on the third, we're actually transitioning our menu to add some even more exciting mm. flavors. Yum. Okay, yeah. so now this is going to go into what looks kind of like a waffle iron. And but what cool. is that? It's so this is just a hot press, and it's got, like you saw, that perfect kind of yep. customized cutout to fit that thing in there. Okay. We flip it over, set it in there for, again, about 10 seconds. You're going to hear some it's beeping. It's like an ice cream panini. It is. It's, I'm making a real sandwich and here. And if you saw the donut in there, it's protected inside. I call yes. it a cocoon, a donut <laughs> cocoon. Okay. So we'll take it out there. What's fascinating is that you'd think that the ice cream would melt in a hot press like that. Correct. Completely but because of the melt. amount of time we leave it in there, it's protected. Okay. You're going to see when I cut it over here. You cut it open. Okay. Just cut it right in half. And right through. And, and then, right so there. So you can see the ice cream is still there. Yep. And perfectly frozen. And then we're going to grab a little bit of vanilla icing. Okay. Put it on top here. And we've already discussed that he's taken out all the calories for us, so you don't yep. have to go to, to the gym for the rest of the day after using it. They're imaginary these. calories today, <laughs> correct. And then we put some strawberry crumble on top. Okay. For the strawberry shortcake finish. And yep. And voila. And that is that. That's just amazing. Now, what is your most popular flavor, do you think, so far? I know you guys have only been open since Saturday, but you can probably tell the crowd coming yep. in orders a lot of? The cookies and cream smash donut. Yeah. And actually, the number two is the strawberry shortcake. Strawberry shortcake. shortcake. So, yeah. And what's the most popular milkshake? The one you made, the Oreo Yonas. Oh, and he's uh, not just saying that. Oh. Well, thank you so much. Yeah. Well, this is such a great concept. I think it's great. The whole family's going to love it. Yeah. Let's say you're taking the kids out to the soccer game or the baseball game this summer. They definitely need to come in and get a little treat for the summertime. A yeah. little ice cream, a little smash donut, a little smash milkshake. Just going to go ahead and show our audience our, our finished product right there. And for the second time today, I'm going to smash my face <laughs> with a smash donut. Can I just try this one more time? I know Derek and Harper, you're probably sick of watching me eat a bunch of desserts, but. Is it, no, Ooh, we're not sick of it at all. God. Did you hear Harper oh just say, God. oh my gosh, good for her. Oh, wow. We are, we are a bit jealous, oh. Lauren Kelly. <laughs> That's incredible. Tell us everything. Describe that it in great fantastic. detail. It's very sweet and savory. Now, I feel like I have a lot of strawberry shortcake on my mouth. Do I have it all over my face yet? Because I definitely feel like it should be there. If not, it's delicious. It's strawberry. And if you like donuts and ice cream, this is definitely a place that you need to stop in. All good Pardon things me, I'm take another to bite, love, though. Lauren Kelly. Thank mm. you so much. Mm -hmm. You've got your work cut out for I'm you out there. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see you later. Have fun.